Hello and welcome to another Grandstream video guide. In this video, you will learn how to utilize the batch deployment feature available on the Grandstream Wi-Fi cordless IP phones WP800 series. The main function of batch deployment is to synchronize the configuration from one WP device to other WP devices in the same network environment. In this deployment example, we will synchronize the existing Wi-Fi settings on WP phone to two other phones in default settings with no active Wi-Fi connection. Batch deployment feature is available from the phone LCD menu under settings, advanced settings. Go ahead and enable batch deployment. When you select hotspot, it will display hotspot SSID and password. By default, all WP devices are configured with this SSID information. This allows WP devices to connect with other devices through this hotspot and transfer data. Now return to the previous menu and select Deploy Profile. You will be able to configure the options that you want to deploy. For example, this phone we are setting the batch deployment on already has the Wi-Fi information entered on it. So, we will sync the Wi-Fi information to other WP devices so they can connect to the same Wi-Fi network. There are other basic settings that you can synchronize using the batch deployment feature such as information about the provisioning server, firmware server, and phonebook download URL. Next, we need to select the deploy mode. There are two options, no confirm mode and need to confirm mode. No confirm mode will allow any new phone requesting batch deployment to just automatically upload the settings defined in the deploy profile. For need to confirm mode, you will need to select and confirm the devices that are allowed to sync the profile settings. If you click Deploy Softgate, it will display the devices detected through the hotspot and from here you select and confirm the devices to provision with the profile settings. You should be able to see all the devices that have requested the configuration file in the requested devices list. Note that there is a limit of 10 WP devices that can connect at one time. Now let's look at the two factory defaulted WP devices to see if they obtained the configuration information from the main phone. If you check the Wi-Fi status on one of the two new phones, you can see the phone has already obtained the Wi-Fi information from the first configured phone. This concludes the video guide on WP Wi-Fi cordless IP phones batch deployment. Thank you for watching.